Hi guys, today I want to talk to you about density and pressure. So what is density? Well density is the ratio of mass to volume and here we've got our equation to calculate density and density uh, with the symbol rho is measured in kilograms per meters cubed and to find out what density is, what the value of density is, well we take the mass of an object in kilograms and divide it by the volume of the object in meters cubed. So what about pressure? Well pressure is the ratio of force to area. So pressure measured in pascals or newtons per meter squared is equal to the force divided by the area in meters squared. The relationship between pressure and depth. So for a given liquid, pressure is directly proportional to the depth or the height of the liquid. So pressure equals rho gh, and I'm going to show you where this equation comes from. Well, if we've got pressure and height, so the pressure in a liquid uh, and the height at the bottom there, well, the gradient of this graph, which is pressure divided by height, is actually gravitational acceleration times by the density, rho, of the liquid. So the further down we go, the greater the pressure. And if I've got a liquid with a higher density, they'll also have a greater pressure. The manometer. Manometers measure a pressure difference by balancing the weight of a fluid column between two pressures of interest. The barometer. Well, a barometer is used to measure uh, air pressure. So there's an uh, air pressure acting down, and then that is supporting a, uh, a column of mercury, and these two pressures are equal. If the air pressure increases, the uh, force on the, the liquid in the dish in the mercury there, well, that increases, and that's forcing, that forces more mercury up the tube. Uh, and there's a vacuum at the very top, and you just read off a scale and that will tell you the, the pressure, or the atmospheric pressure. Okay, so pressure equals rho g h, where does that equation come from? Well, firstly, think of a cube uh, with a weight or a force uh, acting down uh, at the bottom there. And our cube of our liquid uh, has got dimensions uh, L. So our cube, uh, it's uh, got a height of L, the width and the the length all of L. So we know pressure equals force divided by area. And in this case, the pressure, oh, sorry, the force is equal to mg. We also know that the density is equal to the mass divided by the volume. Uh, so rearranging that, we get uh, the density times the volume is equal to the mass. And put this all in our equation at the very beginning. So we get pressure equals uh, rho v. Uh, uh, times by g divided by a. Now we know a is equal to l squared and v is equal to l cubed. So pressure equals rho l cubed g divided by l squared. Well, uh, we can uh, simplify this as rho l g. And well, what's l? Well, it can be the height of the liquid. So we get pressure equals rho g h. Okay guys, hope that's been useful. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Bye for now.